Hey guys, so I haven't made a video in quite some time, but I don't even care, to be honest. Um, I wanted to do what's in my everyday work purse, and so um, I wanted to show you guys what I carry every day to work. So yeah, so first off, I have the Louis Vuitton, you know, here it is, ooh la la, ooh la la, the strap is a bandolier strap, it's actually very light pink, you just can't see it because the lights are so bright, but um, yeah, it's actually kind of dirty because, well, it's light pink. Um. So let's get started. So I just want to say this bag can hold a lot of stuff to be exact. This is what's in here. All of this is, I carry this every day. This weighs like almost 10 pounds. <laughs> I use my purse as a weapon basically. Oh yeah, also this is my monster. It's not from Fendi. I actually got it off of Etsy is real animal fur. Um, I could try finding the link, so if you're interested in the monsters, I could send, I'll put like a description, if the store is still up. So yeah, this is one of my favorite monsters, like I think he's so cute. So, yes. Okay. So like I say, this holds so much stuff. So I'm gonna start from the, f the front pockets up here. And I usually just walk around with my purse like almost wide open, which is probably like not a good thing. I should probably like close it or something like a little bit, but not me. Anyway, so let's just get started. I'm doing the front side of purse first. So I always carry my 3DS everywhere. It is the Galaxy Print. XL. It's a very beautiful device. I play a lot of games on here. <coughs> so I play, usually I play my DS at lunch break, my lunch break. Then I carry my iPhone charger for the car. And then I also have my AirPods in here. Love them. I think this is just might be too bright. Ooh, that, that's bright, that's bright, that's bright. So yeah, I got this cute little um, AirPod case on Amazon and it comes with a little bow. And once I get my Never Full, I'm just going to attach it on the key ring on my Never Full because that will eventually become my everyday bag and I'm gonna just keep these this bag for the weekend. So this is all stuff coming from the front of my bag. And then I got my mini wet brush. Then uh, I drank this tea today my coworker gave to me. It's from Tazo. I am I'm now into drinking tea. This is vanilla bean macaroon. It's it's pretty good tea. It's a dessert tea. So I wouldn't drink it all the time. Um let's see. Then I have this Hollister like little like perfume mist. It smells like the 90s. It smells like my childhood. It's one of my favorite scents. Um then I actually have my boyfriend's watch in here. I have to give it back to him. He left it at my house and I had it in my purse, but then I forgot to give it to him when I saw him yesterday. So yeah, he wears MVMT if anyone wants to know. It's a genuine leather flat watch. <laughs> so I have that in the front of my purse, chilling. Then I have these oil absorbing sheets i just got the walgreens like the pharmacy brand because i'm not gonna spend like ten dollars on like the actual branded ones then i have like four oh no i only have three three p lights to go then i have some purell then i have all the medicines that I will have to probably take if I get a migraine. <coughs> so the front of my 
purse is now empty. So yeah, so now I'm going to show you guys what's in back here, in my other side over here. So then I carry my um, CBD, my hand cream. If you guys are interested, I could try linking it here. It's like, the, the label's really shiny. Um, this cream, I personally think it really works for muscle pain, not really for bone pain. But, um, definitely good cream. It is $75 for this little bottle. So it is expensive, but it works for me. So if I could find that online, I could also link it if you want. Then I carry my Gucci key ring things. Then I have my agenda, my Louis Vuitton agenda. If you guys want me to do what's in like my agenda video, comment down below. Because I'm not going to open it up because that could be like a whole video that I could do. Then I actually have my mini wallet because I went to the club bar over the weekend. So I ended up just putting everything in this. Then I have my actual full wallet, which I probably should just put this in here. I think I'm just going to do that now. Okay, well that's not going to fit, but I'm just going to do that after in this video. Then I have this cube for my charging charger. Then I have this charger that my iPhone just sits on. And now for the middle pocket, which also carries quite a lot. Like, I have so much crap in this bag. It's just so amusing that you could fit so much stuff in this purse. So then in the middle pocket, I have my Tarte um, mascara. Then I have my C-bands. Then I have this cute little Frenchy like, compact mirror. Then I have some Listerine. Could never go wrong with that. Then I have just have a bunch of organic gluten-free lollipops. Um, they're made for sore throats because I've been sick. And then I just have a bunch of anti-nausea medication. So basically, here, I'm just going to actually put everything back on the floor. Basically... You could fit quite a lot in here. Um, <coughs> um, it's crazy how much crap you could fit in here. So this is all the shit that is in my purse. Um, I think that is quite a lot. Hi. Hello. Hi. How you do? So, um, I guess I'll end the video. I'll end the video now. Um, so you can fit all this stuff in a Neo now. Um, yes, my purse is actually not authentic. Um, but I do own some authentic Louis Vuitton and Gucci items. Like, this is authentic, and this is authentic, and then I have two authentic... Louis Vuitton purses, which I have come to realize, sorry guys, that they are not worth um, their price. So um, I personally think that you should just probably invest in a really good replica over the real real. Um, so that is my advice for you guys. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I have... I just ordered a bunch of stuff from China, so I might make a video on my replicas, or might just hoard everything and just open it with you guys, so it's like an actual genuine, um, like, expressions on how I think if they're good or not, I guess, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, this is everything. 
I hope you guys have a great, fabulous day.